Kuz, first of all, how would you describe the way Kristaps played tonight? Um, he played very aggressive, and um, he had it from the jump. I think he understood his assignment. You know, knowing that Rudy was always going to you know, be a, a helper defensively, so he's always going to be back. So, you know, we just took advantage of it early. You know, I think I had like four assists and two minutes just kicking it back to him because um, just how their play style. And then, you know, once a, a talented player like KP gets hot, it's hard to turn his water off. And um, he kept it rolling all night for us. It seemed like you guys were pretty aware that he was close to his career high, and then uh, everyone was very happy once he got it. Um, how would you describe that sequence and what it was like kind of being part of it? Uh, it's always fun when you can get somebody a career a career night. It's uh, very, very hard to play in this league. It's very hard to do anything in this league. And uh, anytime players can have um, career highs, it means a lot to them. And um, as a player, you understand how much it means. And this is good for KP to... One, get out of a little slump he's kind of been in, and, you know, he carried us the whole night. You guys are now a quarter of the way through the season. What have you and your teammates learned about this team? Uh, I mean, we got, we got a lot of work to do. We got a lot of work to do for sure. And you know, I think that, um, you know, for the most part, you know, when we're clicking um, offensively, we're usually a better defensive team where, that can be the case. You know, I feel like we have to consistently be defensive minded every single night and let that kind of just carry us. But, um, you know, first 20 games, 11 and 10, yeah, we got we got work to do. So this this was roughly the point last year where the team started to slide a little bit. Granted, there were injuries and illnesses, too. Mm -hmm. But how did it, how does this team avoid that? Um, we're we're all gonna fight. We're gonna fight. You know, last year we gave in, we and we quit, and um, that's not gonna be us this year. So, Kyle, for you, I guess there's a couple threes that you hit in. I think three threes maybe in the third quarter. I guess what did that do to kind of just keep them at bay? Um, it it, it did a lot. You know, I think the entire game, you know, they really didn't want to play, and they came out, gave us a big punch. Basketball is a game of runs, and we we just took their run, and um, it was a very very important moment for us because you know we were up 20, and then they got to 10, had a little momentum, but we just just kept going and kept going, and uh, it worked out for us. A lot of teams are better at home than they are on the road, but given how many road games you guys have coming up, how can you improve? Uh, how you guys have played away from D.C.? I mean, we got to lock in. We got to lock in. We got to be aggressive. We got to understand that teams are always going to make runs. And our confidence can't waver from other teams' runs. And it's going to be a very, very important stretch for us. 17 out of 23, right? That's what it is. It's extremely important to pick up road wins because you want to protect home in, in this league in a regular season. And, you know, if you can go 500 on the road, you know, steal a couple of games, then you're putting yourself in position to um, not work as hard when April comes. Wes pregame kind of described, you know, coming out of the three-game skid, an air of desperation that he got. He wanted you to guys to play with against. Kind of what was the mentality that you guys started the game with? We were real loose, um, loose but focus. I think we understood. We 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 knew how they were going to play us, and we just exploited it. Plain and simple. We did a great job. West did a phenomenal job tonight. Um, you know, with his rotations, timely, with his adjustments, um, and game plan. So uh, it was an all around team win. On the rotations, actually, you've kind of been a bit of the bridge with the second unit, I guess. What do you feel like you can, you know, provide in that role? Um, you know, we've had some issues with our, our second unit a little bit this year, um, just from a consistency standpoint. But we ha also had injuries. And um, for me, I, I think that's a, a time and place where I can be really, really aggressive throughout the game. Obviously, if I'm, if I'm playing with KP and, and Brad, um, you know, I'm trying to just um, trying to figure out the word I want to use. Be the glue. 
and figure out and, and get guys the ball. But when I'm playing in the second unit, I can be more aggressive and get downhill and um, also still play make as well and uh, go against second unit level players. So, What did you think of Gaff meeting Anthony Edwards at the rim twice there in the first half? Uh, I was extremely happy for Gaff today. Gaff had a phenomenal game. Uh, I think he's been in a little, little slump lately. Um, you know, might not be happy with you know some of the minutes he may be playing, but he came out and played with phenomenal energy tonight and really helped us out. Um, you know, his activity level was was huge, and um, it was just glad to see him have a good game like that. Yes. Cool. Thank you. Thank you.